Fox 47 News at 9 starts now. Good evening. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Cammie Raisler. And I'm Zach Fuller. New details tonight. An update to a story we've been following. One person is dead and a Mason City police officer is being credited with stopping a murder suspect at a Mason City bar. Police say the officer had to fire his weapon. The shootings happened early Sunday morning. This is new information from Mason City Police Chief Jeff Brinkley today. So here's what we know. At around 1 o'clock Sunday morning, police were called to the Happy Donkey Bar at Federal Avenue and State Street for a report of shots fired. Well, at this time, according to the chief, Mason City Police Officer Noah Freezy was on foot near this area and he heard the shots. While making his way to the scene, he spotted two men running towards him, one of them being 25-year-old Jelani Falk from Chicago. While Freezy ordered the two men to the ground, Falk pulled out a gun and Officer Freezy shot Falk. After this encounter, Mason City Police then discovered 35-year-old Christopher Tucker was the victim of the original shots fired call. Tucker from Garner, Iowa, suffered multiple gunshot wounds and was airlifted to Mayo Clinic in Rochester, where he was pronounced dead. Jelani Falk, the man shot by police, is actually facing one count of murder in the first degree, among other charges. He's recovering from his gunshot wound, but already is in custody at the Cerro Gordo County Jail. At this time, we do not know why the original shots were fired. The shooting remains under investigation by the Iowa Division of Criminal Investigation.